NASA says it's still deciding whether to keep the Boeing Starliner crew aboard the International Space Station until next year. Those two astronauts were supposed to return to Earth back in June. Rekha Munaraj in the newsroom now with more on what came out of a NASA briefing this afternoon. Rekha. Yeah, Len and Mia, the bottom line is NASA needs more data and time to look at that data before it will be ready to decide what happens next for astronauts Butch Wilmore and Sonny Williams. And liftoff of Starliner and <laughs> Atlas V. The pair lifted off on Boeing Starliner more than two months ago. It was supposed to be an eight day mission, but some of the thrusters for the capsule's reaction control system failed during its approach to the ISS. Now, NASA could now bring the Starliner home empty for safety reasons and then bring the astronauts back on SpaceX's next flight, which is actually early next year. But for now, they're going to need more data on possible safety issues on the capsule. I know that uh, that they're making the best of this time, but I'm sure they're eager for uh, a decision just like the rest of us. The main thing we're looking at is the propulsion system and the kind of information we're getting is uh, is there's a lot of folks out there that have worked with similar thrusters and have seen similar issues. Today, Butch Wilmore's family said he's taking the delay in stride and they're preparing for the possibility they won't see him until February 2025. Yeah, you just so, sort of have to roll with it and you sort of expect the unexpected. NASA says it hopes to make a decision on the astronauts return sometime next week. So Len and Mia, they'll have to sit tight in space a little longer. I appreciate the wife's positive outlook there. Very calm. <laughs> very, very calm. Eight months later. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Rekha Mutaraj, thank you.